Oh, this is Spawn Point. So if you follow me on Instagram already, you'll notice over the last couple of weeks I've upgraded my desk setup. And one of the things I want to do next is I want to add some lighting to it. Now on my TV downstairs, as you're aware, I've already got the LifeX Z strip, which wraps around the back of the TV. Um, I use five meters of that, and it allows me to create some awesome colors and themes. And as I've enjoyed using their products, I've decided to use the LifeX Beam in my desk setup. So in this video today, I'm going to go through the installation, the setup, and the final product at the end as well. So let's take a look. And inside the box, which I think is really clean and minimalist as well, you get six beams, each with sticky tape on the back. Um, you get magnetic ends to attach them to each other, a corner piece to design the layout on your wall. Um, and then you get a Wi-Fi adapter, you get a plug, an adapter for your country. And then the setup process is pretty straightforward, just a case of attaching the power adapter via the magnetic strip to the beam. And then it goes through a setup process where it goes through various colours um, just to show that it's connecting. And the next part is to jump onto your iPhone or your Android device and run through the setup. So it's pretty straightforward. It's just a case of connecting to the beam via your Wi-Fi and then running through the setup on the LifeX app where it allows you to rename the beam. It allows you to connect it to a particular room and to assign it to a group as well. So in this case, I'm calling it the desk beam, which will then be assigned to the office room. Now, the first time I set this up, I actually used blue tack to attach it to the wall, just to give me an idea of what it would look like at the end. So if I wasn't happy with the layout, I could remove it easily before peeling the sticky labels off. Um, and I've attached the Wi-Fi adapter under the desk in this little cradle as well. And then it's just a case of feeding the cables up to the light. So now the lights are on the wall, it's a case of showing you how to change the colours. So there are about 15 or 20 themes already on the app that you can choose from, or you can create your own. So it's a case of swiping right, and then you can paint in the beam any colours you wish, and then you can save it to your favourites as well. Then under the effects tab, you can actually have the theme animate or colour cycle or move to music. So just in case of choosing that option. And as you would expect, it integrates well with Google Home, Amazon Alexa, and Apple HomePod. Now, I personally use it with Google Home, which I have speakers throughout the house, and it works well because it means that I can continue to control the lights using my voice. Well, I really hope this video has been useful to you. Um, it's just a quick overview of the LifeX Beam, how I've installed it on my desk setup. Uh, don't forget to follow me on Instagram, so that's at SpawnPoint. And if you've got any questions, just drop them in the comments below.